We're going to do a startup video here on this 1948 Dodge Power Wagon for uh, Sean over at Car Collision. Uh, I'll go over a few of the details. Um, modernized four link front end, I mean rear end, uh, corporate 14, coilover shocks. For the power plant, we've got a, a new Cummins 4BT supplied by uh, Big Bear Engines. Uh, we've paired that with a uh, Five-speed overdrive Tremec 4050 from uh, Chad McKinney over at Quick Draw Brand with your basic NP241, which was used in the uh, 89 to 93s behind the six-cylinder Cummins diesel um, chain-driven transfer case. We have a uh, Dana 60 front end um, leaf springs we've put under there. Crossover steering. I don't have that on yet. The, the linkage, but the linkage is made. Um, hydraulic winch conversion. Hydraulic motor stuck in there. That's driven by the uh, power steering pump. We'll have hydro boost brakes on it. We've also got the customer selected color. Uh, a very unique, uh, almost uh, burgundy, but not really. Almost, I don't know, cross between primer red and burgundy. Uh, wasn't sure how it'd look. It looks nice once it's uh, buffed out. Um, we have to add the uh, condenser. Once we put the cab on, we'll uh, put all that stuff in. Uh, we have a temporary oil pressure gauge here set up to make sure we had oil pressure on startup. Uh, we are going to start it up just to verify. It's been done a couple times already. Um, she's all set. the temporary key switch we have uh, next step will be uh, bringing the cab down here we've got to sandblast it uh, get some primer on it do some body work get it on get the steering set up pedals um, get this I'm gonna start it again I'll let you watch the key Your typical Cummins, they start. The uh, start easy and we've got our high mount AC, GM one wire alternator. We've converted that. Intercooler. We'll get to work and finishing it. 